what's up guys this is blay here and today we're going to be looking at uh, black desert online so this video is going to be talking about why black desert why i don't play black desert online and why i think black desert online players are the worst action combat players and why black desert itself is a bad uh pvp action combat game so this character here is a ninja and ninja is uh pretty much a basic uh fighter type class like every other class in bleed in blood desert online um ninja is not unique it just has a bunch of uh animations and a bunch of dashes and that's all ninja has i guess in a sense that's how a ninja is um it's not a rogue because the stealth doesn't work in this game it has a stealth mechanic here but if you use it uh i don't even know which key is on right now it has a yeah. stealth mechanic i'm clicking one all right there's the stealth all right, look how I'm moving. I mean stealth and I'm moving like this. I might as well just not be in stealth at all so that I can just move around. And then it's gonna drain out slowly. All right, so that's not stealth. Um, that's basically, that's a that's a stealth game for, that's a stealth mechanic for a game like a snake. Um, that's a metal metal gear solid or something like that right where you just crouch down and then move very very slowly that's stealth that's the type of stealth there um like hitman type of stealth but in in actual mmos where you have invisibility right this that is not how invisibility works in uh in most mmos right the way how invisibility works is that you go stealth and you can actually move fast or even faster than your actual movement speed right um so that separates bdo from actual mmos that have uh pvp and actual stealth mechanics and assassin uh class mechanic this here is a fighter this is not an assassin this here is a fighter fighter that move really fast has like a bunch of dashes and Another problem with uh, BDO that most players don't understand, uh, players who don't know how actual action combat PvP games works, is uh, the animations and abilities. All right, there are a bunch of abilities here. BDO, BDO has a bunch of abilities, but players who play this game and uh, claim that it is like a great PvP games. Uh, fail to understand the fact that all of these abilities are actually not useful in actual PvP, in the actual PvP that they experience in this uh, Black Desert Online game. All right, so that's one of the ability. It's an ability. It's an ability. That's an ability, and stuff like that. All right, all of these abilities are here, but these you cannot use in in actual. Uh, in actual PvP because Black Desert PvP is a uh, is a uh, tab target uh, tab target PvP with a bunch of action as fillers, right? What this means is that your hit point disappears the moment you get cut, right? So let me just let me just say this one more time: your hit point completely disappears the moment you get cut, right? So the reason why this is tab is because you have to keep moving and you have to keep uh, clicking animations and doing stuff like that so that you don't get cut and see all these abilities that I'm using right you cannot use these in PvP because if you use them you risk getting cut right um, all of these fancy abilities that are here these are all PvE abilities where you are playing against mobs um oh another thing is that a lot of people uh explain like how awesome BD, uh, video is um and how great the, the action combat is 
the problem here is that the mobs you are playing against don't actually have any intelligence on them the ai do not have any intelligence on them they are like they just stand there they are like test dummies right um and a lot of uh player this is why i don't think i don't i don't take a uh, video action combat players seriously because I don't think they are they are action combat players. In an actual action combat games, there will actually be AIs with uh, intelligence that actually challenge you, right? Um, in this game, however, the AI do not challenge you at all. They just stand around and you just hit them and just kill them. So that's why these abilities, all of these abilities, that's what they are here for, so that you can use it against targets that will just stand there and not uh and not do anything and just allow you to will at them right that's what these these fancy abilities are here for right um otherwise in pvp the, the reason why it's actually really bad in pvp is because unlike the dummies actual humans who are playing this game want to move around they don't want to get hit so it's because they don't want to get hit they'll be using all of these abilities these abilities that looks really fancy that looks like you are supposed to be using them on targets they won't be using them on target they'll be using them just so that they, they can uh, use blocking abilities i mean just so that they can be recognized as blocking abilities right and that's the problem like 100 percent of the time you will not be attacking your target 100% of the time you'll be running around clicking wasting these abilities these fancy looking abilities Okay, 100% of the time you won't be trading you'll be running around uh, clicking these abilities uh, So that you don't get cut um, Because the, the uh, actual game itself the combat doesn't work Right, that's why you have desync and all of these problems in a game because you actually cannot trade what what does trade mean? so if you are playing games like uh, League of Legends, uh, any, any good action combat games, I mean, Black Desert pretends to be a good game with, I mean, players who, who play about it, Black Desert like to think that they are the, like the best action combat players, but they are not because they don't actually know what, what they are doing, what an actual action combat game is supposed to uh, be like, right? So if you are playing a game like uh, League of Legends, right you actually trade for the most part like it doesn't show like animation lags like it doesn't show you like uh real time actual trading and like actual action connecting right like in uh 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 how you call it? there there was a game that came out i forgot it i'm not gonna try to remember it but um yeah, you don't see the actual action connecting, right? When you when you do something like this, you don't actually see somebody blocking with the with the actual action uh, happening in sync, right? Uh, but League of Legends still have a decent combat system because even though it's it is slow, um, it has a decent combat system because you actually trade, right? In Black Desert, on the other hand, you don't trade. You get you miss your your rotation okay and then you get cut right um your rotation is basically click all of these as fast as you can so that you don't get cut right click all of them as fast as you can so that you don't get cut that's the rotation between a, a human and another human in pvp in pve you can take your own time and click these and uh and attack the enemies because the enemies are not actually going to react to you right um so the combat actually just fails and this is something that that this is the reason why i personally don't enjoy playing this game and i just didn't like it like i and it's just because i play really really good action combat games and i'm actually a, the best action combat game player that i know and so I know like from my experience I know a bad action combat game from a good one and so uh, I just want to put this video out because a lot of people go on reddit and go around explaining like how black desert online uh, combat is like so amazing yes it is amazing in PvE where you are attacking dummies that just stand around and just get hit but in an actual PvP experience 
where you actually want to trade and actually like somebody hit me with a i have to use b right to block that attack it doesn't happen like that in video it's in video in pvp is I click A, I click B, I click C immediately, and I continue to click A, B, C, A, B, C. It's just so that if somebody click A, then the server will already have my, my B, C, um, A, B, C, D, whatever uh, abilities that I click, so that the server can mark that as a, as a black ability, right? That's why you see in most of the uh, fights, you just see players just clicking everything that they can, just, ooh, just clicking everything, spinning around clicking everything that they can and stuff like that that's because the server actually doesn't know how to handle actual combat um, in a good sense right and a lot of players want this I mean uh, a lot of uh, players who want actual combat games look at video and see people clicking stuff around and think that um, that's how action combat games are supposed to be but when you really really play this game if you really if you play all the really good action combat game and you are an actual action combat player you will know that video is a very very bad uh, pvp game um, and it is probably the best pve game because pve is is like well i'm not gonna insult other people like i know i know some people actually like to be challenged right if you are a type of player that like to be challenged then this game is not for you because the pve mobs just turn around literally like i don't even know where these mobs are but they just turn around and you just you just kill them like you just use waste your abilities on them just spam and then you kill them so i want to clarify this because i, I see like a lot of people comp comparing a real real good games with uh, video and comparing the pvp and comparing stuff like that and thinking that video pvp i mean uh action combat style is better than the real real uh meaningful trade trade based uh combat um, games right um so i just wanted to clarify that and yeah so to wrap everything up video is a bad action combat game uh, for PvPers because first off it doesn't have a trading system which means uh, the system that actually makes video desync that's the uh, trading system I'm talking about where like you hit A and then somebody hit B and then both of them sync together and collide and if B was a was a response B would block A attack right um, the video doesn't have that and if you actually press the system to actually implement something like that in in the middle of your combat it will actually crash and that's why it, you guys have desync and stuff like that um, in a real action combat game with real decent action combat PvP between actual humans humans that can actually make decisions right there will be a trading system that's what make the game good right um, and that's something that video doesn't have then as for pve i will like to say video is great but then when i'm saying it in that way it will probably be an insult to actual pveers like people who play games like elden ring and so on um, those are real pveers um, and those those challenge those people who like I mean, there are two categories. There are like hardcore PVEers, like those guys who play, play Elden Rings and stuff, and uh, uh, Dark Souls, right? Those are hardcore PVEers, uh, and this game is not for for hardcore PVEer because those type of players like to be challenged, and in this game, the AIs are just really, really trash. They just stand around, and you just hit them. Like they literally, you can just literally just walk up to a target dummy and just attack yep. it for the rest of your duration in this game, and that will be better. That will actually be more of a challenge than you playing against these things, right? That's how it. You see, do you see the AI? Like it didn't pose any challenge whatsoever. I hit it one time and then it died, right? In an actual challenge based real uh hardcore pve with challenge system with real decent action combat the ais will actually challenge you 
and they will actually use abilities and you you won't just walk up to a mob and just kill it right you have to dodge and do other stuff like that and that's something that BDO doesn't have in fact players who play BDO do their best to avoid any type of challenging AI in the game right if I'm, I'm I, I think there are there's probably like a tiny bit of like challenge in some AIs but these AI are like uh, maybe boss levels or something and the only challenge is like they maybe they maybe hit you like harder and everything about this game is like just hit the person harder and just kill them with one hit right in an actual action combat game with like challenges and trading if somebody try to hit you you will actually have a dodging system video doesn't have a dodging system and the, I know this because you have to click all of these animations you have to do all of the you have to waste all of your attack animation because if you don't do that you won't have uh, you don't have you won't have any data on the server when the other person attacks and robs at the server right so that's why you, you have to do all of this and waste all of these fancy looking abilities all of these abilities that people see on YouTube and think that it is something that you are using against targets you are not using them against targets you are just using them so that the server doesn't uh, doesn't get you cut right you are using them so that you don't get cut because once you get cut there's like no counterplay and there's like no trading system between the game because once you get cut, that's one hit right there, right? So that's what that's what make this game bad. And to prove that this game is like run around or get cut and get one shot in, um, to prove that the evidence that I have is the uh, gearing up system, right? In video gear is everything, right? Um, skills is not. You can just run around, click buttons, and just click what what you've been seeing on YouTube or whatever. And always add blocks or whatever and look at your target and stuff and you'll be good right but the main thing that really counts in this game is the gear because this this uh, this uh, game here half assed uh, action combat game is uh, is chase and, and get cut off uh, because that's how it runs right you need to have a gear that once you catch your target off uh, your target off guard you can just one shot them and if you don't have that gear right compared to other players you can do whatever you want once that person catch you and it, again this game is not hard for you to catch uh, players who are not spamming the abilities right it's not hard so once that person hits you one time you will be dead on the other hand if you are low in gear there's nothing you can do pretty much that's why this game is all about gearing up and getting a pen gear or whatever because that's the only way you can win in this game if you have higher gear and that's why the pay to win uh, system with uh, video was a problem for most people because they needed a gear to in order to survive and like and do uh, PvP with other players because when it comes to PvP your strategy um, your response time and all that, that stuff they don't matter only the only thing that matter is your gear so I play Neverwinter um, that game is way better in combat than this game it used to be way better because they were like a trading system even if you didn't have the best gear you would attack enemies and they won't die like instantly but you can actually attack them little by little and actually trade 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 until they actually lose all of that hit point which is going to take over so a lot of time uh, where they will actually make a lot of mistakes a lot of times uh, which actually makes the game good because um, because if it then proved that you do, you aren't doing it because of your gear you are doing it because of actions and decisions that have been made to actually win the fight right and that's something that video doesn't have if you watch any game I mean any uh, match of between video players is basically 30 minutes of them just clicking these doing this doing stuff like this and so on and then once they get once they once they miss that one time like actually once they stop clicking one time for like one second they get cut and then once they get cut that's it like 
you can basically just change your hit bar to like a, a number that says uh, hit me once and I'm dead and that would be good for this game um, so that's the problem with uh, video combat that the players who play this game don't understand they don't know what actual action combat is um, well action combat for PvP and for PvE like real challenge uh, they don't know what that is but they enjoy spamming their abilities and spamming everything and just you know and just looking for gear that will uh, that will like protect them in a sense that will that will hide um, how bad they are at actual action combat games so if you have any counter argument to this uh, I would like to to help you strategize how you're gonna respond to respond to me uh, first tell me how the uh, gearing system in this game how is it fair between uh, somebody who is uh, new and doesn't have the max gear uh, compared to somebody who have uh, pay to win gears and then next up tell me how this game has a synced uh, trading system which type of which type, what type of uh, talents or basically action in this game uh, marks it as a trading system uh, um, action combat system uh, game right explain that to me because I don't really see it the only thing I see here is desync uh, combat and people just uh, spamming animation because they don't want to get uh, cut off and once they get cut they, they instantly die right so explain uh, explain that to me and then also explain uh, which type of challenge this game uh, provides for like action combat uh, PVEers, he, uh, people who play uh, Elden Rings and Black Desert, I mean, uh, and uh, Dark Souls and stuff like that. So, if you can actually make an argument for uh, against everything that I've said that actually makes sense, right? Um, which I doubt 100% that anybody can actually do that because honestly when I'm talking about something it means that I have actually done my research and I actually like I have personal like I have a deeper understanding than majority of the people that actually have that that actually in that field with me um, so <laughs> I don't even know what I'm going on a tangent now so that's what I want to say uh, this game is a it's just a bad game um, a lot of people don't see it because they are casual casual players um, and they really don't know what action combat is if you want to know what real action combat is play something like uh, like um, I think Dark Souls, Dark Souls is a d decent action combat uh, PvE game and play something like if Neverwinter was here back in the days you could play something like that um, and actually experience the game like World of Warcraft League of Legends is a very slow game um, that's why I don't play it's, it's way too slow play something like a uh, Hero of the Storm those are decent action combat games right uh, even the AIs in Hero of the Storm a mobile game are actually way better than the uh, AIs in this game the game doesn't even have AI. They just have like uh, character models that just stand around and you just kill them. So that's my little rent. Um, not really a rent. Just that's a very very detailed, clearly explained uh, uh, content I'm being posted right now to you guys about this game. And a lot of people like flashy stuff. I mean, look at look at how this guy stands, right? He looks so like crazy, right? People like this, right? People, this is why people play this game because they have the character that looks like this, and when they click on ability, like that, they see these effects, and it looks very fancy. That's what people like. I think that's why, that's why um, these players play this game. Right, and if you play video, uh, if you watch their videos, all you're gonna see is like particle effects. You don't, you will never see actual decent gameplay. You just, be, you just see flashes that literally want to blind you. Um, that's part of the, that's part of my evidence. Like, you never see decent animations. 
you only see these. I mean, the game had decent animation, but you would never see it because the game is not a synced uh, trade based action combat game, right? Real action combat game will allow you to trade, and that's something that this game never, never does, and it will never be capable of doing. Uh, because if it ever tries, it will, it will start to have desynced, desyncs, right? So, uh, I'm just gonna say in this verse and uh, end the uh, recording here. Thanks for watching, and I don't really care if you are angry. Uh, just make sure that you are not insulting me. Uh, you should just make sure that if you are arguing, just be get to the point. You know, talk about the game and talk about the points that I made in this in this uh, video, and that will be fine. Um, yeah. It's just a little tip for you to not make a fool out of yourself when you uh, uh, make your counter argument to me. So, thank you. Bye-bye.